Hello everybody and welcome to the very first fly tying video produced by the folks at alaskaflyfish.net. My name is Flashback Max and I'll be your guide for the next little while tying what we have right here in the vise and that's a beadhead marabou leech. It's a real good fly for the lakes in Alaska. Um, hey, you can use it in streams too. So uh, when we go over this guy here, just a tail, basic uh, marabou tail for the body. It has just uh, some wound marabou with a nice little uh, flashabou uh, rib in there. Gives some, you know, a little more attraction and uh, for the topping a nice wavy uh, marabou wing. You can change it up, use different colors, you know, olive works well, black of course. I'm using brown, good standard uh, all around color. Let me get this guy out of the vise here for you and put in a fresh hook. Like I said, uh, tie this leech up. Uh, it's just a standard, uh, you know, streamer hook, size six, uh, a nice uh, gold bead, and uh, using uh, just regular uh, six out thread. And let's get this on here and tie this guy. I'm gonna wrap back to the to the bend of the hook. Snip this tag end up. All right. Take this nice uh, blood marabou feather and we're going to make ourselves a tail and a body out of this. Basically you want the tail maybe a little bit shorter than the than the hook length itself. Maybe just a little bit. Get that guy in there. A couple three good wraps around. Keep him in there good. Don't clip this off. We're going to use that. But first what I want to do is tie in the rib. And this is just, you know, regular flashaboo. Same stuff. Pearl that you'd use for all kinds of other flies. Get that in there. Let that trail off. Alright, what I'm going to do is just loop that back around like that so we can tie it. And I'm going to move it all the way up to the front. And just, uh, just take it around. Nothing real special. Just kind of alleviates the need for uh, chenille or whatever. Tie this off at the end. Like so this guy clip this tag part off now we're gonna take this nice little rib here wrap that up get that don't worry if it disappears into there once it's wet this stuff really you know takes off in color and will be really pretty cool looking alright snip this off now we'll get ourselves a nice nice fluffy another piece of marabou here you want to measure this carefully because you want the tips of this to be the same size same length as the uh, the tips on the tail so that looks that looks good right about there to me I'll clip that off like so get this in here now you can just tie that in there good now, you could just leave that, but you have this big, kind of unsightly looking bare spot here. So what, is, what I do is I take some dubbing. This happens to be sparkle dubbing or, or whatever. Dub that on there. And that just kind of covers that, covers that spot up and gives us a little, little added attraction. Now I'm just going to whip finish this guy off. Uh, I'll take them out of the vise and have a look at them. Uh, real good fly, like I said, for, for the lakes up there. Nice, uh, just nice overall trout pattern to have in your box. If uh, you guys have any uh, flies you'd like to see, please either email Jason or me, and uh, we'll uh, see if we can get it done for you. 